Introducing the challenger from Kansas City, weighing in at 275 pounds, Baron Corbin. Introducing the champion from Dublin, Ireland, weighing in at 267 pounds, he is the world welterweight champion, the Celtic warrior, Sheamus. Stay tuned. And we're ready to go, folks. A big time title defense here, and this crowd knows it. They're coming unglued right now. I know these superstars are excited to compete here in the same city where superstar Billy Graham defeated Bruno San Martino for the WWE Championship back in 1977. Moving up through the ranks in impressive fashion, we get to see Baron Corbin in the matchup once again. For those who are unfamiliar with him, what can they anticipate out of him here? Nobody knows how to make a statement quite like Baron Corbin. I mean, here's a guy who won the Andre the Giant Memorial Battle Royal in his first ever match on the main roster. If that's not making a statement, I don't know what is. All I can say is he definitely looks the part, and sometimes that helps, believe it or not. so ruthless now that's how you use a table to your advantage he wants no part of the outside he's taking a long time to get up guys perhaps playing a little possum here Cole I don't believe it and that table can shorten careers Michael only one place to go when you're stuck in the fireman's carry yeah down and I can tell you it's not a pleasant trip His shoulders are down. And the champ kicks out. Yeah, seemed to be just testing the waters a bit there. A punishing axe handle. Uh-oh. I'm afraid to think what's going to happen next. The champ looking a little uneasy here. This match is clearly taking its toll on the champ. Hey, he can still win this thing, guys. We've all seen him come back from much worse. Apparently a change in plans here. I don't know why. He seemed to have him right where he wanted him. Now there's the counter. Nobody home for that one. No kidding. There weren't even any lights on. Oh, he turns it around. Drops the elbow on him. I wish I could tell you guys what this superstar thinks of this week's power rankings, but when I asked, the only thing I got... He goes for the quick pin attempt and a quick kick out from Baron Corbin. Just needs to do more damage. On the shoulders here. And it could be a long way down from there. A bad place to be for the challenger. And you have to wonder how much the challenger can sustain at this point. Oh, man. His chances are dwindling quickly. He's just taken on so much punishment. This is where we find out who the better man is. And at this point, it could very well be either one of these guys. That's how close this thing is.
Looking at it here. And Sheamus powers out. He showed up here tonight for a fight, and that's exactly what we are seeing. Sheamus is going to have to improvise because he's not seeing any benefit to his current strategy. It just doesn't appear to be the champ's night. There's no way he knows where he is right now. Heck, given the punishment he's taken, he probably doesn't even know his own name. I don't know. I don't think he truly understood just how dangerous his opposition was heading into this match. Of course, he understands that now, but it might be too little too late. Taken out with a power bomb. Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. Well, better not think too long, though. This is exactly how he drew this one up. Will he be victorious? Two and a half. Is the ref deliberately counting slow? Wow, I thought this was over. Despite having quickly into the cover with a title on the line, we have a new champion. Ladies and gentlemen, that's a very big win here tonight. That's the kind of win that makes you feel good.